Okay, let's get started. Open one of your favorite browsers. I prefer Chrome and go to Microsoft.com. Now search for the app uh, you want for free. We are talking about uh, paid apps, not for in-app purchases. So take one of the apps and prefer, I'm taking uh, here for the example this PDF draw board and uh, it is cost is 384 Indian rupees. Now copy the link of uh, this app in the URL bar. Open a new tab and go to this website store.rg-adgod.net. Uh, link is given in description. You can copy it from there. Now in the search box of this page, paste the link that you have copied. It is uh, the link of the app. Now click on the tick box. Wait until the links are successfully generated. Here are the uh, links for necessary pre-requests and uh, the app itself. Until now you are able to download any application from the Windows Store whether it is a game or a app for offline installation purposes. After downloading all the pre-requests, download the app itself. Note down that you have to download the pre-requests for your uh, according to your system architecture. Here I am downloading both x86 and x64. I uh, think you should do so. Now install all the pre-requests as I have already downloaded them and installed them so I will not be going for that. Now install the application itself. As the app is installed, now I'm going to launch it. As you can see here, it shows check your account. Uh, that means store uh, Windows 10 store has detected that we have not purchased this app, so we cannot uh, use it. Now the trick begins from here. Okay, now I install this application. You will see the magic of it later in the portion later portion of this video. First of all, extract uh, this and another application. This is for the backup purpose of our uh, installed app. Okay. Now open WS app back. As you can see, the application is asking for enter the app path. So we will be going to get the app path. Go to this PC, then C drive, and then to program files. And now go to view and uh, unhide the hidden files. You can see now there is a folder named uh, Windows Apps. Right click on it and uh, click on uh, Take Ownership Pro. Now you can enter this folder and look for the app you have uh, installed and also check the sizes of uh, the app folders. It may be varying two or three folders but with different sizes. Take the highest one 
and copy the path of the folder from inside. Now go to the application and paste this path. Okay, next step is enter the output path where the application and it is a certificate will be generated. So I'm going to take the path from the folder where from I'm operating for the ease. Okay, I will be choosing this path. After pasting it in uh, the application, the application uh, hit enter and the application starts packing the Apex again and generating certificates. Here, uh, everything is done. You will be promoted uh, to create a password for the certificate. Choose none. And now our application is generated. Okay, open the apps. Here is my application. Now, first of all, install these certificates post to PFX and into the local machine. You will be promoted for user uh, grant access, so provide the access. Now, install the certificate itself. Uh, same in the local machine. As you are done, First of all, uh, uninstall the application that you have previously installed. Okay, uninstall, yeah, done. Now, install the application. Launch the application now. Whoa, as you can see, it's working perfect. Here is my app working perfectly. Thanks, guys, for watching this video. 